Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and today we're going to be showing you how to make a fission reactor. So I'm going to build this now and before I build this make sure to like subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss another video. So now let's start building this. So I'm going to make this a 7x7 seven seven, but in my solo world I make this a 12x12. 12 12. You're going to need a few materials a lot of materials. I was like, the crafting recipe for one of these fission fuel assemblies is pretty insane. Same with the other, the control rod assembly. They're pretty insane. But so yeah, I get that out. But so what you're gonna do is that I'm gonna make a seven by seven square, and you're gonna have to fill it in right here. So now you're gonna, you should have. Okay, so now we have a seven by seven square. Next, you're gonna wanna go seven blocks high. We've already gotten one block high, so you're gonna need to go six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then you do that the same for all the other sides, but you're not gonna fill anything in. The only thing you're gonna fill in is the bottom, which is already filled in. So let me make this and so now it's complete so now you can you can actually fill this in if you want you can fill it in but I like using reactor glass so you're gonna fill this in with reactor glass okay guys we're back so we've done we filled everything with glass and as you can see I also filled the roof with glass you don't have to do that same thing with the walls, you don't have to make it reactor glass, but I like seeing in it. So, what, next you're gonna need to get your control rod assembly. So it's gonna be like a checkered board where it's gonna be in like this a format. So there's gonna be a gap in between every other room. So it should look like this. Now if you're making it an odd number, like one of the sides is gonna be like this. So one of the sides, gonna be only two well, it's fine you just need to have it in this format where it's like a checkered board so next you're gonna need your fission fuel assembly and you're gonna get from the control rod assemblies you're gonna bring it all the way to the ground with the fission fuel assemblies so let's fill all of this in and we're almost done filling all this in There we go. So now we're gonna fill the last one in and then we're gonna close this up. And when you close this up, if you've done it correctly, you should see it, that red particle effect. So I'll show it again. That, that's how you'll know. And if you right click it, you'll see this. Now you don't have any fuel or coolant, so, or water, but. So that's where these fission reactor ports come in. So I like putting one here. Do there, and then one there, and then finally one in the back. Okay, guys, we're back. So we got the configurator, and this is gonna configure our ports. So what you're gonna do? Shift, right click. I like the front one to be output waste, and then these are gonna be input only, and this one's gonna be output coolant. So now what we're gonna do is that we're gonna need some uh, fission fuel and we're gonna need water so first let's get our fission fuel now this is actually pretty hard to make so I'm just gonna get a creative chemical tank with it I'm gonna pump that into there now we got fission fuel now for this we're gonna have a pump and let's get an energy cube okay guys so we got our pumps now let's link our uh, pipes to it and there we go. So now we're getting water. So let's go to now this one, which is the output coolant. And right now, at least I don't need the coolant. So we're gonna take this pressurized tube, put it in this chemical tank, and then we're gonna make it so that it dumps the steam. Now, if you're gonna use the steam, then don't dump it. Otherwise, I like to dump it. 
And then, we're actually gonna need a solar neutron activator. Because what I like to do is that I like to actually turn this into polonium. So now everything is set up. And so let's go here and now we can activate it. So if we activate it, these those are gonna start turning blue. And then we're gonna start getting steam. So now if we just do dumping access, you can see that the steam is building up. So let's just put on dumping. That should dump most of it. And then over here we got our solar neutron activator. So let's make it daytime so that you can see this in action. And so now starting to make uh, polonium. So this is the fission reactor. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Turn on notifications so that you never miss another video. This has been Nathan. Peace out.